Hey guys, how's it going? Uh, welcome to Living Tomorrow Today. So I want to fill you guys in on where we are with purchasing the RV. Um, I think we have finally found the RV that we are going to purchase. Um, we had originally looked at the Crossroads Volante um, that had the front bunk, but yesterday we went back to Explore USA in Canton and we ended up finding the 2019 Crossroads Zinger um, ZR330BH. <laughs> it's a huge name. Um, Nicole really just loved the layout. This is an entry level travel trailer. You know, we're getting we're getting a lot of the things that we want, but I expect that there will probably be some issues with it, just like there are with any RV, no matter how expensive. But obviously, you know, the closer you get to entry level, I think um, you should be able to expect maybe some more issues, but hopefully not. I don't know. We'll see. The reason we are going with this RV is because it is within our price range. It's the layout that Nicole wanted or it's a layout that she really liked for the kids, um, for us. Um, she really loved that front bunk layout because it gave us so much room in the master, but it really just left no room for the kids in the bunk room. We just, we were actually at uh, Explore USA yesterday and 30 minutes before they closed, we just happened to go look at this one and she loved it. So it's a 2019, which is also something we didn't want to do. I really wanted to buy something um, that was at least a year or two old um, to fight off some of that depreciation, but we haven't gone to an RV that just feels right when we go into it. And yesterday this one felt good. So I'm Nicole's happy, I'm happy. I am getting ready to start the negotiation process. Press three for sales. Hey Derek, is uh, Steve available? Hey Steve. Okay, sounds good. Okay, so what they are going to do is work on a price for me. Yesterday when we found it, like I said, for as you heard me say, for some reason it was not on their website. I don't know if they just got it shipped in or or what, but for whatever reason, it wasn't on there. Yeah, so he's going to work up a price for me. I'm letting them know that I'm going to continue to do some research and search some more. And I kind of dropped the hint that I found some that were a couple of states away that I'm willing to go get. Um, so my goal is to come up with a good price. Um, and to be honest, it's, I don't think it's based, it's priced that bad. It, it might even be a very good price. I've looked at a bunch of them um, on RV Trader and on their own website at all of the different locations. So that's where we are right now. When he calls me back, we'll follow up. <clears throat> Hello? 26063. So when she gets off, I will run this by her and hopefully we can go by and um, start the process, what, what would be the next step? So they knocked off $1,400 off of the cheapest price that I found. So that's pretty good. And so far the process is going really good. I'm going to do the credit app um, on their website and that's gonna go straight to the salesperson. And then I locked down that RV with a $250 deposit that I will get back if we change our mind or we'll go directly to um, the cost of the RV if we keep it. Um, so I'm going to do that credit app and then uh, we'll go from there. I went ahead and asked them also to send me the extended service plan. I was debating on whether to do that or not and I'll probably make a whole separate video on that but short answer is I think I'm going to. All right guys, well I submitted the application. Uh, it wasn't too terribly hard. I just had to log into my mortgage company and get a little bit of information off of that. Now I just gotta wait. All right guys, so we just got here to explore USA and we got Nicole and everybody and we're gonna check out the RV and see see what we think. They have it hooked up for us and turned on so we're gonna finally get to see it with the power. And um, yeah, so let's go check it out. So it comes with, it comes with the outdoor kitchen that I really wanted. Um, I think this is something that we're gonna really use. Um, more than I think we planned. So I'm really, I'm really glad that we are hopefully gonna get this one that comes with the burners. Oh, look, there's even It's prepped for solar. That's nice. Disbelief and make me forget my remembrance. Find a car you can't 
support Plan something we both know Let your hair out in the wind Put the pedal to the floor Flame your light and take a smoke Put your broken rip off wafers on Doesn't matter if the sun goes down We'll still be up, still be up Don't care about the place we found We'll still be up, still be up We're in this together We both fall down Doesn't matter if the sun goes up Cause we will still be high when the time So it hits at every single one of our checkpoints, I believe. Yep, it's got the fireplace. Fireplace. Two bathrooms, or a bath and bath a half. Bath and a half. Bar. Bunk, bunk house, yeah. A, uh, a nice bunk house. It actually seems like it would be functional because yeah. there's tons of storage and space and even like an empty area underneath that they can use as a hideout. Um, our room has actual like walking space, you know, behind the bed. You're not like trying to slide up next to the bed. You know, it, it has a nice like gray it. interior. It's a little dark, but it's not horrible. It seems to have a lot of uh, cabinet space too, as well as a small little pantry. I think our room is the one that's lacking the most on like storage, but it's not horrible. I mean, yeah. I think it's pretty run of the mill. Oh, it also has an outdoor kitchen, which he yeah. really, really wanted. Yeah. It has... It's already pre-set up for solar. Oh yeah, that was nice. Yeah, it's got the solar. Is that 50 amp? 50 amp, two AC units. Um, yeah, I mean it's got. Every, I think the only that's good. the only thing it doesn't have is the master over here. That's Which good. is okay. Yeah. It's fine. That was the one. I mean, that was one thing that Nicole and I also really liked because it was nice all the space that it gave us. Um, but. Um, I mean, other than that, it's still a, a good layout, and it has everything we wanted. I mean, including the island, which is nice. All right, guys. Well, that is, um, this is our RV, or <laughs> the RV that we're looking at. Um, so we will decide soon if we get it. Um, tomorrow, maybe. And we'll see. We'll go from there. Leave a All like right. and subscribe, yep. like always. All right. Talk to you later. Bye. Bye.